Hello, my name is Russell Gold. I work for ECLE, Local Governments for Sustainability, the world's largest network of local governments working on sustainable development. We advocate for the protection and enhancement of biodiversity. And there are a number of economic benefits which even businesses and local governments can construe from doing so. Green roofs and green walls are prime examples. They can help to regulate internal building temperatures and thereby reduce the need for energy intensive heating, ventilation and air conditioning. So too, urban forests and urban vegetation can play a very important role in mitigating the urban heat island effect, which is this excessive build-up of temperatures in cities compared to the surrounding regions. And the savings can be considerable, given that in some cities as much as 40% of total energy consumption can be attributed to heating, ventilation and air conditioning. We also argue that biodiversity can help to absorb storm flow and storm water and thereby reduce the required drainage infrastructure necessary for, for draining that excess water. Um, so there are real savings to be made for businesses and for local governments. Biodiversity constitutes the very foundations upon which our societies prosper. Biodiversity mediates the flow of ecosystem services upon which our societies so heavily depend. Businesses too. And the TEEB, which stands for the Economics of Ecosystems and Biodiversity, the TEEB Manual for Cities, recently produced by my office, Eclay Cities Biodiversity Centre, can help to provide the proof for those arguments.